Get your paper on yourself for this coming confrontation Cause we all under attack in this wicked ass nation Better get with Jason Black, he got the useful information Stay on code as he exposed all the Satan machinations He ain't talking about shit, he ain't talking reparations We'll show your ass a right, those were peaceful demonstrations All eyes on free, cause we all family That's the way it fucking was, and that's the way it's gonna be What's up everybody? This your boy, bless the damn best, coming at you once again. Okay, I'm going to set this up for y'all right quick, right? As you can see on the screen, we got Brother Polite. And one of the things that he was known for, besides bogus status correction, is he claimed to be able to legally maneuver in a courtroom that will virtually get you out of any case is bullshit as you will see in this video I know of a lot of y'all have probably met these Moorish sovereign citizen cats that babble about the United States don't have jurisdiction over them and blah 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 and blah 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 but right here we will are about to witness how much bullshit this is whereas a nigga will say anything on the internet but it when, when it comes down to real life like a courtroom or a damn bank that bullshit babble goes out the window so here we go about you know status correction right now there's a video floating yes, out about you right kill him yes, with sir. the paperwork kill him yeah, with the yeah, paperwork no doubt and you're talking That's about you know your, your personal experience with the court system now the way you got out of that is that included in your status correction program no that'd you. be absolutely absurd but you can, you can use the part of the status correction that is called for, that calls for a political legal disposition. But that's where we establish ourselves as a body politic, as a body politic to put. Here we go, right here. That word body politic, nine times out of 10, when you hear a nigga using that word, prepare yourself for the plebiscite babble the pressure on the people because they realize that this person is part of a legally registered community that makes up a certain populace or a certain amount of people but as far as me being free representing myself that is because i knew certain rules of engagement going into court and plus we attacked the judge's bond and three attacks on the judge's bond and then, and he and if this sounds like jay morrison's plebiscite babble to you ding 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 you, you don't get any reasonable prizes but yeah if this sounds like jay morrison's plebiscite babble yeah you got that right and by the way these dudes who are in and out of prison yeah they're very good for slick talking on folks who can't follow the construction of a sentence and a fool and his money are soon pardoned that is called for that calls for a political legal disposition, but that's where we establish ourselves as a body politic, as a body politic to put pressure on the people because they realize that this person is part of a legally registered community that makes up a certain populace or a certain amount of people. But as far as me being free, representing myself, that is because I knew certain rules of engagement going into court and plus we attacked the judge's bond and three attacks on the judge's bond and, it, and he doesn't revoke the attack on his bond, he has to recuse himself. The rules of engagement was as follows. The door opened and they all stand. Oh good, I'm so glad. He just, now he's saying, I'm gonna tell you what the rules of engagement are. We got the judge to drop this, that, and the other. I'm gonna explain the rules of engagement. The rules of engagement are as follows. I'm so glad he's gonna give us a very simple to understand step-by-step -step program of how you can use status correction in court. Great. Finally, he's gonna shut Jason Black down and finally we can all hear it in plain and simple English. Fantastic. This reminds me 
of the first couple of times watching a Dane Calloway video, I would listen to him babble for 45 minutes, waiting for him to get to the point or even prove a point. And right when we get to that part, cue the music. I'm just here to make you think. Himself. The rules of engagement was as follows. The door opened, they say all stand, boom, all rise. Okay, everyone sit down, then my people come into the court. Hey, uh, are you aware of the accusation or the nature of these charges? I'm aware of the nature of the charges, but not how they apply to me. Okay, how do you plead? I'm not here to make pleas nor plea bargains. I'm here on special appearance to challenge the court on the grounds they lack jurisdiction over organic living soul. Well, we're gonna put a plea in for you anyway, Mr. No. Objection on the grounds you lack jurisdiction over organic living soul making violation of Article 3 of the Supreme Law to the land. Listen, that's just satellite information. Now, did you hear how he babbled and, and just spilled that off? First of all, as if such a thing could actually happen in a court. People, I got three words for you that explain why that garbage he just said will never work. The three words are contempt of court. You walk into a courtroom, you start saying that garbage, and a judge is just going to pick up the gavel. You ain't going to get that far. He's going to pick up the gavel and, and say, if you continue this, I will hold you in contempt of court. And you ain't gonna be able to find this string bean nigga nowhere to help you out. Himself. The rules of engagement was as follows. The door opened, they say all stand, boom, all rise. Okay, everyone sit down, then my people come into the court. Hey, uh, are you aware of the accusation or the nature of these charges? I'm aware of the nature of the charges, but not how they apply to me. Okay, how do you plead? I'm not here to make pleas nor plea bargains. I'm here on special appearance to challenge the court on the grounds they lack jurisdiction over organic living soul. Well, we're going to put a plea in for you anyway, Mr. No. Objection on the grounds you lack jurisdiction over organic living soul making violation of Article 3 of the Supreme Law. Your Honor, you can't. This is the garbage he says you're going to say in court. You don't have jurisdiction over an organic living soul. I'm not here to enter a plea. I'm here to challenge your jurisdiction over an organic legal, organic living soul. Okay, well, we'll enter a plea for you. Objection on the grounds that you do not have jurisdiction over an organic living soul. What planet did this guy immigrate in from? If you... Folks, could you imagine any attorney anywhere going to law school and then telling the law school that this is a legal argument that you could actually make in court? Nigeria, come get this nigga. This is what happens. Y'all let these scammers run around and whatnot. The Nigeria money, y'all just let the Nigeria money scammers go on. Next thing you know, it metastasizes. Poof, polite. This fella just told you that you can use status correction. And if the judge attempts to send, I am here. I'm not here to enter a plea. You're not here to enter a plea. That's very interesting because that's exactly what we just heard you tell the judge you were doing. That's exactly what we just heard the judge say that you were doing. Isn't it? signature over the name Michael Noah. Is in, that in fact your signature, sir? The statutory maximum penalties provided by law for the crimes for which I am now pleading guilty. And then it has a signature over the name Michael Noah. Is in, that in fact your signature, sir? Yes, sir. All right. And I am now going to place my signature on this plea agreement in that I am now going and have you reviewed each and every component of this plea agreement uh, going through page one and page through page four? I have. Now it says on uh, page four, having read the above mentioned terms of this plea agreement and having been advised by my counsel, David Terras, I, Michael Noak, freely and voluntarily enter into this plea agreement. What happened to, I reject, I, uh, I refuse to enter a plea on the grounds that you don't have jurisdiction. What happened to that part? 
because according to the judge in Florida, he went straight to the plea part while telling everybody else that he doesn't need to do that. But according to the judge in Florida and the audio recording of himself, yeah, he, he, uh, he went straight to plea. You all didn't hear any of that damn Perry Mason babble when he was in court now, did you? Again, this reminds me of our brother, Dane Calloway, right? Right now, he's in court facing charges of stealing pictures and mislabeling them in one of his books. And somebody gave me some information that said he went in court and admitted to lying. Y'all can look it up for yourself. Just Google Celeste Inez Sayas versus Dane Calloway in New York court. He wasn't trying to be Perry Mason Black when he got to court now, was he? He didn't sit there babbling that garbage then. Now you're in a place where things got real and there will be consequences if you attempt this mess you do on the internet. So if he truly believed that stuff he was saying on the internet, he would have been saying it in court. The blind lead the blind, but this isn't even the blind in this case. This is the treacherously, criminally dishonest is what you're looking at. This is the treacherously, criminally dishonest. You've been dealing with a no account vermin who's been running around for years and years whether it's his kind or the Jay Morrisons or anybody else, you notice that happens. They will sit here and look you in the face. I created the black channel because I wanted to have a repository of reliable information, not a bunch of broken, beaten, defeated niggas out here daydreaming about some stuff they can never do because reality is too brutal. This is a fella who told you that he had the financial problems of America figured out. Then you find out the niggas flat broke, living off a bunch of chicks. You have a fella sitting up here telling you that he's got a bunch of women to deal with. And then you find out he's getting his R. Kelly on. Meanwhile, advertised to the internet for a decade that, oh, it ain't like that. I got my finger on the pulse. If the rest of you knew what I know. If the rest of you knew what I know. And how many of you sitting in this room right now, listening right now, hearing my broadcast right now, you got took, man. How many of you got took here? How many of you got got swindled? How many of you have listened to him or others? These days, it seems to be all about the optics. Everybody want to talk. Can't nobody stay on topic. It's all about his power and how we feel to take it. Some of y'all still sleeping. Y'all the ones who ain't going to make it. We done with the ills. Now it's time for the do. We ride and fuck a party. They done closed down the club. Strips can't even strip no more. Nines only fans. Ain't no live sports song. Cause it's only on demand and that's good. So now we got to focus. The song was real. Okay. Every time we look around, we getting killed. Fuck that. So fuck 12. We finna do this shit for George. Yeah. Fuck the judge. Yeah. Fuck the jury. Yeah. Fuck the judge. Yeah. Fuck the charge. Yeah. We been fed up and the rage is getting higher. We fucked around and found out the devil afraid of fire. So now when we get turned up, shit get burned up. I see a lot of soldiers up and neck turn up. And we came to take the statues down and take the crown. I seen it on the news. A crowd of pigs powering down We did all of that Without no marching or no voting We was running through them precincts Leaving shit smoking like Fuck 12 We about to do